Hey guys, Hifto here, and today Mac with an all new video. And in today's video, we're going to be counting down 10 things you didn't know about Call of Duty Black Ops 3. Number 1, and the game's full soundtrack lasts 89 minutes and 22 seconds. It was composed by Jack Wall, the same man who provided the soundtrack to Mass Effect. Number 2, and Dark Horse Comics have released a Black Ops 3 comic book, which serves as a prequel to the Black Ops 3 campaign. Number 3, and the Nuketown 2065 bonus map was supposed to have been kept secret right up until the game's release. However, the map's existence was leaked by the Brazilian PlayStation Store prior to the planned announcement. Number 4, and similarly to Destiny, in Japan Black Ops 3 is only being published on Sony's consoles, these of course being PS3 and 4, meaning there'll be no Xbox or PC version available in the country. On to number 5, and many of Black Ops 3's seemingly new features can actually be traced back to Call of Duty World at War. World of War or COD 5 as it was also known, is the only other Call of Duty to have had an open beta, co-op campaign and custom zombies. Moreover, Treyarch has already confirmed that the selection of Call of Duty World at War maps will be remade as DLC in 2016. Number 6, and Black Ops 3 is the only game in the series to date in which a player can start a multiplayer game without a single weapon. Number 7, and the campaign character Rachel Kane, who appears in the mission Rise and Fall, was originally called Kanye Kane. The character's name was changed to be the same as the name of the voiceover actresses. Number 8, and during Black Ops 3's ad campaign, Call of Duty's official Twitter began posting fake news stories, such as a terrorist attack in Singapore. It's needless to say, the stunt didn't go down well, with Activision having to make an official apology afterwards. On to number 9, and if you remove the heads off of all the mannequins in Nuketown 2065 in under 2 minutes, the mannequins begin to move and attack the player as if they were zombies. And finally number 10, and Black Ops 3 has a total of 47 achievements, that's only just over half of Advanced Warfare's 90 achievements. Hope you've enjoyed this video, if you found out something you didn't know before watching, please just take one second, hit that like button, and thanks for watching.